Okay, let's be honest. These lyrics really wouldn't make it anywhere else. When I step on the scene, y'all know me cause I walk with a limp. Like an old school pimp or a real OG. I'm rocking Vans. I'm in the sand. Got a Red Bull and vodka up in my hand. Hey, you're looking kinda cute with that polka dot bikini girl. Hey, this is what I wanna do. Take off that polka dot bikini girl. Drink all day, play all night. Let's get it poppin'. I'm in Miami, trick. <laughs> What happened, music industry? No, I'm serious. I really want to know what happened. I'm a musician, and when I hear lyrics like this, I get angry. Because honestly, they're not good. I'm not saying anything against the band that wrote them. Congratulations to them for the success that they've had. But honestly, music industry, how could you think that this music could sell? And that's what really gets me. It has. The only reason that this song sells is because it's a good dance beat because DJs in the clubs can use them. In my opinion, that's not honest music. For someone who does have musical talent and is trying really hard to get to the top, it's frustrating to hear this kind of stuff on the radio. Here's another one. When I'm into D-Town, Dallas, what's up, bro? When I'm into a pull pally what happened, folk? When I'm in Chicago, they hollering, now what's up, Joe? Now I'm back to Mississippi, they, Mississippi, they telling me, what's up, man? They telling me the same thing. When I'm in New York, what's good, son? Just hustling. Really? Those take no talent at all to write. None. It's a famous song that I'm sure most of you have heard. Now, once again, I'm not criticizing this artist for being successful. Congratulations go to him. But honestly, I could write that. And I'm not the greatest at writing lyrics. But I'm better than that. Now, just for comparison, here's something that I wrote. It's been three days and I'm starting to worry. My head feels numb and my eyes are blurry. I can't stop the pain from running through my brain. I miss the place where I used to go. I try to remember, but I just don't know. Let me be in this place. Let me out of this place. Tragedy knows only those with no names. A lesser known impact lays its claim, leaving us behind, running out of time tonight. Tonight I lie awake stuck in this state. A lesser known impact claims my name leaving us behind, running out of time tonight. Now I know, the two subjects are completely different. Partying, kind of a downer song. But still, you could write your party song a little better. I'm in no way blaming the artists at all. Okay, kinda. My main focus is on the music industry itself. When lyrics like these are allowed to become popular songs, that's when I take notice. Many people say rap is dying. I say rap is dead. Granted, not all rappers are bad. Lil Wayne, for one, is extremely successful and I'm a big fan. T.I., Jay-Z, Kanye, I'm a fan of all of them. There are those certain rappers out there that just don't have the stuff that they do. And that signals to me that rap is in fact dead. Or at least on its way to being. Now, I don't want to attack a single genre. There are some extremely bad rock lyrics out there. And some really bad pop ones, too. But in today's popular culture, rap is what's popular. So rap is what's heard on the radio most. Rap is what's being released most commonly. And hip hop. So that's why it was brought to my attention. Okay, bye. Just stop it already.